Email templates are saved emails that are used repeatedly to send email from the database. They allow the users to send quality communications without having to compose the same text repeatedly. Creating different templates that are tailored to specific situations let the users to choose the right message for the right audience. This increases the quality of the message and overall engagement rate with the customers. So let's see how can we manage email template in Odoo 16. So in order to manage the email template, first you have to manage with the developer mode. Ensure that you have enabled the developer mode. And now let's move on to the settings of Odoo. And here we have a tab called technical. When you just drag down under email section, you can see email template. So we know that email templates are saved emails that are used to avoid, I mean, that are used for uh, repeatedly, repetitive sending of the emails from the database. So here you can see the email templates that is created by Odoo and this is currently filtered by the base template. So as you remove uh, this base template, you will get all the templates that are currently available in this database. So let's manage with a few uh, template so let me consider the template of sale order confirmation so you can see that uh, sale order confirmation sale order quotation i mean uh, sale order cancellation then uh, send quotations everything we can manage with uh, email template so as a customer confirm his uh, quotation we know that that will be considered as a sale order then uh, the customer might be receiving a sale order confirmation email so in order to manage with that we have to make a template first or you can just custom a template so currently i will be explaining with the template that we have already created or that is created by the Odoo, and you can just use the mail so here you can give the name of the uh, email and we can also set that to be applied and you can also just get into the internal link of the applies and that shows all other further details of the template like the applies to and you can provide the subject that is uh, with a basic of code and you can also provide the template description that is we will be sending uh, this to the customer on order confirmation and in this content you can provide the content that to be sent to the customer so here this will be the content i mean this will be the structure of the content like hello your order with the sale order number amounting to the amount that has been confirmed and thank you for your trust and do not hes hesitate to connect us if you have any questions and that will be sending by the admin and here you might be getting the details of the product and if you want to add the attachments it is very easy to add the attachments over here and if you want to add further details or anything uh, or you if you want to make any customization you can just choose the backslash and that would allow you to add the bullet list numbered list checklist table separator cards code to columns three columns or four columns or you can also ha add any other formats like headings with different um yeah size and switch directions you can also add text and if you want to add media such as image and all you can insert that and you can also make a navigations with a link or a button and you can also add widgets with three star and five star and you can also add some basic blocks such as signature and you can also add marketing tool from this list so if you want to add that just use the backs backslash and here we have a email configurator where we have to uh, just configure the mail and here you can set the frame which is we have uh, set over here and you can also set this as a default recipients and you can also provide the two uh, email and two partners cc reply to and schedule send date and under the settings you can also provide the language that this mail to be sent and the outgoing mail server and the auto delete options as well as the optional report to print and uh, attach and report file name now uh, yeah when you just move on to the outgoing mail server here you need to ensure that you have properly set an outgoing mail server and ensure uh, the connection is tested 
and as you just test connection you would be able to see that the connection is currently successful and you have to fill these details and afterwards you need to configure the mail over here then only you can send the mail to the customer now let's see how can we uh, just manage uh, another template for the CRM so let me just search for the lead uh, here yeah we will get uh, CRM something or that is related to the template or you can just uh, choose any um, yeah template randomly just use the sale order cancellation so as the customer just cancel the sale order the customer might be receiving the mail upon the cancellation so let's see how can we manage this so in order to do that yeah here you can see every details and if you want to make this default recipient you can just choose this field and under the settings you can set the outgoing mail and from this mail the customer might be receiving the mails so let me configure that and let's move on to the sales module and let's create a quotation so let me create a quotation by choosing the customer so as you choose the customer ensure that you have set a proper mail id for the customer so into this mail uh, i mean the customer might be receiving a email from the company uh, that is the outgoing mail server that we have configured and here you can choose a product so let me choose a product as book and i am going to confirm the order so let me confirm the order and here you can see we have just confirmed the order now let's make the delivery and let's set the quantities and let's validate this so once we set that yeah we have done with the delivery and let's move on to the order and let's send by email and you can see this will be the mail that we are going to send that is the sale order confirmation so we can just send this and if you want to save this as a new template you can also save that so as you send this you might be getting a mail so let's see that mail here you can see the mail that is received for the customer so you can see the uh, body that we have given and all other details along with the attachment now let's move on to the sales module now let's cancel the quotation so let me i mean uh, the sale order so as i uh, try to cancel the sale order here we can send a mail uh, to the customer so you can just click on send and cancel so the customer might be receiving a mail here you can see as the customer is uh, cancelled the sale order he might be receiving a mail on sale order cancellation like it will be with the message of please be advised that your sale order with the sale order number has been cancelled and with the further details so thus is the main advantage of the email template that uh, let you to save the emails that are used uh, repeatedly to send the emails from the database so hope this concept is clear for you as always stay awesome and thank you for watching the video